Title rivals Lewis Hamilton and Max Verstappen are set to do battle once again in 2022 and their teams, Mercedes and Red Bull, may well have tricks up their sleeves. Lewis Hamilton and Max Verstappen have been accused of playing games during testing as they seek to hide the true speed of their 2022 cars in Bahrain. Sky F1's Paul D. Resta believes their respective teams, Mercedes and Red Bull, are saving their power ahead of the new campaign and new testing in Bahrain. There has already been one three-day test in Barcelona, billed as a shakedown by F1 and the teams are expected to bring plenty of upgrades to their new cars in Sakir. The circuit is the host of the season opening Bahrain GP next weekend. There has been discussion over whether the new era of regulations paired with the fact teams had to design new cars, aimed at improving overtaking, could mix up the grid order in F1. However, both Red Bull and Mercedes impressed in Barcelona and were sitting at the top of the leaderboard, which suggests the 2021 title rivals remain the teams to beat. Despite their ominous offseason, De Resta believes the two teams are hiding the true power of their respective cars as the season draws nearer. I think they're playing games to a certain extent, said Sky F1's De Resta. I think both Red Bull and Mercedes, what you're seeing and what you're hearing, are saving a lot until the end. As it is the final test before the season starts as well as the venue for the opening race, teams are expected to bring more advanced packages to Bahrain. It should provide a better idea of which teams are leading the way. Many believe that Mercedes, the octuple champions, may be bringing a significant upgrade to the desert with rumors of one that gives them around one second extra per lap. Ferrari and McLaren have suggested they won't necessarily be adding to their current setups as they seek to optimize what they have, but fans still expect some improvement. Ferrari and McLaren, F1's most successful teams but distant from the top two last year and for some time, appear to have significantly closed the gap. Sky F1's Karun Chanhok believes the iconic teams will be back in contention in 2022, adding, I think we'd all be pretty shocked if Red Bull and Mercedes are not at the front. But I don't think we can rule out Ferrari, and I think McLaren are also in the hunt. The 22 race 2022 campaign, which was set to be a record 23 races before the Russian Grand Prix was cancelled, begins with the Bahrain Grand Prix on March 20th. Ah uh -huh.